special group of women are in San Diego for the next few days. They joined the Navy before women were allowed to be sailors. They were trailblazers in every sense of the word, and I was very lucky to meet them today. By a Navy They're singing and cheering at the Double Tree Hotel in Little Italy. More than 50 women. Anchors on their lapels and on their ankles. There is a sisterhood, de definitely. These women are Navy waves. They were hospital corpsmen, air traffic controllers, radio men, and techs. Some did aircraft maintenance, too. I love this one of her leaning up against the plane. That's our work uniform. WAVES stands for Women Accepted for Volunteer Emergency Service. And I kept it. These women have a proud history. We were way before our time. They have invited us to their annual reunion. But we had had no contact since 9, February of 1969 when we graduated. Jeannie Morshead and others joined the Navy when it wasn't a popular thing for women to do. Some people said, oh, they're looking for a husband. And I had sailors coming up and saying, what is your rate? Because they had never seen a female chief. But they all say they'd do it again. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Absolutely. Barbara Henderson served on many ships, now tattooed on her arm. They've all been decommissioned. These women had to fight for everything they had, including respect. I can Before we left, Gail Wursthorn picked up her bugle and started playing taps. The women wanted to salute their fellow waves who were no longer here, wishing them fair winds and following seas. Two. Two. That's wow. when this reporter shed a little tear. That was, um, it was really moving. It was absolutely, and these women, they joined the Navy in the 1950s and the 1960s, part of the 70s. Uh, and as you see, they're wearing shirts that say waves. Oh, and I forgot, they're also, if you see them downtown, they give me this backpack. Um, if you see anybody with this on their back, it says U.S. Navy Waves Reunion. Go Love up, it. please. Thank them for their service because sadly, a lot of people don't recognize them. The recognition long overdue. They're just starting to get it now because they're wearing the shirts. They're, they're obviously making their voices known. So if you see anybody in downtown San Diego, those are some tough ladies. Well-deserved recognition, for sure. A really awesome bunch. I'm humbled to meet them today.